I'm Pony Girl Rolls, and welcome back to another one of our Minecraft videos. In today's video, we are going to be some doing something that I don't think we've ever done before on my YouTube channel, and that is building our very own stable. Now, this is going to be a short series that I'm going to say mm, lasts around five episodes. Anyhow, as you can see, we got the horses back there, and what we're going to be doing is building our very own stable. You know, all the stalls, the stable, um, the indoor arena, outdoor arena, all that kind of stuff. So here's the village, and I've actually already gotten the stall layout here. So we can go ahead and get started on the stalls, and soon the other rest of the stable. So let's go ahead and do this. See, I think I'm going to be using birch planks, like this right here. I've built a couple of stables, um before Minecraft. I'm gonna be honest, they uh, they weren't that good, so I'm hoping this turns out good. <laughs> but, you know, we'll, we'll see. I don't know. I'm honestly not that good of a builder. I'm, I'm not good at all. <laughs> I just build. Alright. Let's see. I think I'm going to have, like, a fence here. Not like they're imprisoned, but like it's a window. You know, like that. Yeah, I think that looks pretty good. Right. Let's add this. Hello, villager. This village needs to be repaired. It really does. I think that's something I want to do for my stable. Like, I need to repair this village. Because this is an exquisite... Exquisite level? Fantabulous stable, people. So we gotta make sure the town looks good, too. <clears throat> There we go. Alright, so we've got some good foundation. Something you should always do when you're building is, um, you know, make sure you know what you're going to build. Sometimes people freestyle it. Um, I freestyled stuff before in Minecraft, and it's gone fairly well sometimes, but other times, not so much. Alright. Hmm. And some hay. I think I'm going to have hay, sand, and podsel. If I pronounce that correctly, I don't know. I use this um, podsel stuff a bunch when I'm building stables. Like, a bunch. I mean, because it looks like it looks like poop or maybe like carrots have been dropped down on the floor. I don't know. It's just the perfect, perfect block for stables. It really is. So I think we're going to mix some sand in there and some poop, whatever you want to call it. Does it look good? I guess it, looks, it doesn't look bad. Let's go ahead and just add some of that. Dab of this. A dab of that. Dab of poop. <laughs> there we go. Okay. I wonder what the horses are going to look like, because we have four beautiful poopy stalls here, people. And I'm very curious in what the horses are going to look like. Alright. So, I guess this, looks, this is looking pretty good. Um, it's going pretty well so far. So, for the stable series, for today's video, I think I'm just going to be building the stalls right now. Um, but yeah, I think this is going to be a fun series. Because I've never really built a huge stable before like this, so we're just going to have to see how it goes. Alright, so here are our beautiful stalls. we got the foundation all nice and set up. And, oh, that's right. Let's go ahead and add some privacy so the horses can have some privacy, you know, when they're pooping out carrots. <laughs> okay, here we go. And I might add more stalls, by the way. Um, I just thought I'd start with four because, well, why not? <laughs> Let's go ahead and pull up some gates. I think I might, hmm, would this look good? I, I don't know. I'm trying out new things for this. Oh, no, I don't think the horse can fit through that. Right, we're just going to have three gates right here. See how it looks. Okay. I think it's time to get started on the roof. And um, I think for the roof... Um, what am I going to use? Let's look around. I don't, I don't think I want to use birch, because I don't want to put too much birch. Um, how about quartz? 
Yeah, smooth quartz sounds pretty good. Why did I get a block? There we go. We'll just use... Um, which one is... I can hardly tell the difference between quartz and smooth quartz. We'll go with... I think this is... Yeah, smooth. We'll go smooth. Okay. Oh, we're getting somewhere now. <laughs> Let's see. Yeah, that's good. Okay. I hope at least. Alrighty then. So here is the start of our roof. I don't think I'm going to make it flat. I think I'm going to kind of like make it look a bit pointy. Um, maybe. But if that doesn't look good, then we'll have to make it a flat roof. But I, I feel like it would look better, more barn-like, stable-like, if I make it the pointy style. And I don't think I'm going to be using those three horses. And the reason why is because they all look very similar. And I want to try my best to have each Thor these horses to look different. Like, you know, um... Have a bay, a chestnut, a dappled horse, that kind of thing. Mix it up a lot. All right. Here we go. Doo -doo -doo. Is the sun already setting? Okay, time set day, please. There we go. Okay. Well, this is going very slowly. I think what I'm going to do is go ahead and stop recording, and I'll get back to you all when I'm finished, because all I'm doing here is just building up the stairs, and I feel like that's um, kind of boring to watch. So I'm going to let you all go. There's our roof, and it looks very interesting, doesn't it? Just floating. And uh, is that a cat? Oh, we can have a barn cat. Forget about the roof for a moment, guys. We need a barn cat. Okay, you know it. All right, uh, let's see. Fish. I'm just going to go in here. Uh, do, 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 do. Let's see. Fish. I think they eat raw cod. No, no, no. Don't run away, please. Don't run away. Oh, I love calicos. They're so cute. Okay. Let's get some white dye on the calico. Let's see. Oh, look at the eyes. So beautiful. All right. So let's go ahead. Uh, come on, calico. Oh, I love cats. I'm a, I'm a full-on horse cat person. You all know it. <laughs> all right. So let's go ahead and put up our pillars once more. Let's just stretch them up all the way to the roof. Like this. All right. They look good. Yeah, it looks pretty good. Okay. Then next, I think what I'm going to do is get some more birch planks and just keep on stacking them up. So this way it's, you know, these are four stalls, but um, they look more barn-like than anything. So that's the point I'm trying to get across. Okay. All right, this is actually looking really good, like, pretty good for me, like, my building. It kind of looks like, it looks horsey-like at least. Yeah. I'm debating, do you think, do you guys think it would look better if I, like, add this at the bottom? Oh, yeah, that looks way better. Yeah, we'll do that on the, the front side, too. When I've added... Planks. Okay. Uh, let's see. I think it goes right here then. What am I doing? What am I doing? Okay. So, yeah. I. Some of you who watch my channel, uh, you don't have to, you know, love, love horses. But I'm going to take a wild guess and say, like, half of you, if not all of you guys, are horse lovers. I mean, who doesn't like horses, really? I mean, even if you don't ride them. They're really cool animals. They just really amazing. Right. But yeah. Um, horse just amazing and 
horsey content is just as amazing as well. <laughs> I watch a lot of equestrian YouTubers a bunch of the time. And um, I, I wouldn't call my channel like equestrian. I, I wouldn't call it at all. I'm just like, I talk about horsey stuff like I am right now. Sometimes I do horsey videos, but I would not say my channel is based on horse stuff because, well, it's more as based on gaming. <laughs> All right, so we've almost got the stalls finished. Let's go ahead and I think stack these up at least one more time and fix this. That looks very peculiar. Is it like that on the other side? Yes, it is. Okay, then. Let's grab some fence. I've only I've only made this barn style, this um stall style once. So um yeah, that's why I kind of know what I'm doing, but I, I'm going to try to follow with this color scheme, you know, the bir birch planks, and hopefully this will go well. If it doesn't, you know what? It was still fun to try, right? All right, so I think we are ready for our horses. Are we ready, Calico? We're ready. Okay, let's get the horses out. Ta-da! Boop! Oh, look at the pretty... Wait, doesn't that look like them? Oh no, I mean, this is a beautiful horse color, but I kind of hope they're not all the same color. Okay. <sighs> Alright, but that, that looks similar to that one, though. Please, let it diverse. Um, okay, okay. We're getting there. Ah. Uh, well. I, set timetable. Uh, time set day. Um. Okay, guys, so, um, look at those four horses, and tell me they don't all look alike. Alright, you know what we're gonna do? You know what we're gonna do? We're going to grab a lead, and we're gonna take the ones out we don't like. Uh, I'm gonna take this one out. And we're not gonna kill them, okay? No, we are not going to kill them, okay? We're setting them free, okay? This is a herd. We're gonna call it the wild herd of this village. Yes, um... Here we go. Hi, herd. Here's a lovely horse for you. There you go. Bye. Um, I'm going to get two more for you. <laughs> I'm a big fan of... Hmm. Well, all three of these horses are pretty. I feel like these two look too much alike, and I'm going to get rid of this one. Here we go. Oh, watch out for Calico. You almost stepped on her tail. Come on. All right. Hi. Hi, horse herd. I got another horse for you. Hi. Okay, I'm, I'm going to bring one more to you. This is going so well. And I know what you all are thinking. You all were thinking I was going to kill the horses. No, I am not that dark. I will not do that. All right. So let's, let's see if we can get three other new horses. All right, there you go. Hi, bye. Okay, so let's see if we are, we have better luck this time at least. Because I really hope they're all just, Diverse, different in their own way, that kind of thing. Okay, that's okay. That's okay. That's all right. That's that's a very pretty color. Yeah, it's kind of like um. Yeah, yeah. It almost looks black from afar, but very brown when you get near. Yeah. Okay. Um. Very similar to those colors, but that's okay. We might just be cursed. Okay. Oh, that's so beautiful. All right. I think these are the horses I'm going to stick with. Um. These two look very similar, but you know what? You, you can't have the perfect horses in your stable, okay? And I'm very proud of these. Um, yeah, I like this set better than the other one over there. So, yeah, this is looking very good. And as you can see, it's very rainy outside, so I think the next thing we need to do for our stable is get some lanterns. And I don't know if anybody knows this, but this is something I'm obsessed with with in minecraft i love absolutely love hanging chains like lanterns on chains it it's something i'm obsessed with i'm not kidding here i i love doing it it's amazing i just love it i love the uh, the effect it has it's just a really beautiful effect i mean look at that it just looks amazing i love it Let's go ahead and let's see. 
over here. Add some lanterns for this guy. I don't know, maybe he's a gelding? What do you all think? He kind of looks like a gelding to me. Yeah. All right, and let's hang one more right here. I can overdo it, trust me. Oh, you can overdo it with chains and lanterns. Uh, did I overdo it here? Um, I kind of want to like, excuse me, horse. Also, we'll name the horses, probably not in this video. Um, maybe in this video, I'll see if I want to name them. I might just have to think about it, but we'll see. Okay, I'm overdoing it, aren't I? Alright, this is enough. This is plenty enough. Okay. So these are our horse stalls. They look fantastic. Alright, so I think the next thing we need to do before we end this video, just gri grab a hoe and... Uh, I'm at the shovel. Shh, this isn't happening. Ahem, what what hoe? What what hoe? No, I, I always had a shovel. I don't know what you're talking about. Okay, there we go. So let's go ahead ahead a little <laughs> ahead and add some pathways to each stall. There we go. Okay, looking pretty good. Alrighty then. Okay. So I think the next thing I'm going to be doing is kind of just doing some little details here and there. Um, I'm also obsessed with these. I don't know if anybody knew that, but I have an obsession with these bushes. I don't know. Do you think this will look good? Well, excuse me, Calico. We will see. We'll see. Um, I don't know. I don't know. I think I... Honestly, if I'm being honest, I'm more of a flower person than anything. So I think we're just going to go with the color scheme of blue and white. So let's just go ahead and put down these flowers. I feel like they'll just better go. They don't have to be even. You know, nature is never even. <laughs> All right. There we go. I think that looks much better, in my opinion, at least. So, yeah, this is our horse stalls. It, I mean, it, it doesn't look bad. I've seen better horse stalls, of course, but I don't think it looks bad. I think the next thing we do before we end this video is name the calico, name the four horses, and we can go ahead and end the video. Let's get out the anvil, and for the love of, will it stop raining? Uh, Oh my goodness. All right. Okay. Name tag. Here we go. So let's start with the calico. Huh. Um, I, I, I don't know. You know what? Why don't we call her Jingle? I mean, it's getting close to Christmas. Um, you know, Jingle Bells. And, um, yeah, I mean, maybe she jingles to let the four horses know, hey, I'm here. So yeah, let's go with the name Jingle. All right. Um, I don't know if this video is going to post before or after Thanksgiving, but whatever it is, is it just me? Or does anybody else feel that Thanksgiving is so neglected? Like, there's hardly any Thanksgiving movies. There's... I don't think there's any Thanksgiving songs. It's just so neglected. I mean, who doesn't love food? I mean, come on. Turkey? Chestnuts can roast on an open fire on Thanksgiving. I don't know. I really don't know. Like, there you go, Jingle. She guards the stalls, you know. Keeps us from our pests. Pe pests? Mouse? Mice? <laughs> you know, protects us from those kind of rodents. All right, why did I get rid of the anvil? I guess that's out of habit. I don't know. All right, here we go. So let's start with this horse. Um, hmm. I don't, I don't know. Uh, I might, hmm, let's take a good look at her. She's spotted. You know what, we'll come back to her. Let's go to move on to the second one, because I don't know. 
I do know what to name this one. That's why I wanted to move on to her. I know we are starting to go into winter, but I'm going to go ahead and call her Autumn. And if we want, we can call her Augie for short. There we go. Hello, Autumn. That's such a pretty name. It really is. All right, and for this one, um, huh. Let me see. We might call him, sometimes I look at Minecraft um, flowers or blocks to try to get some kind of good idea. I might call him Smokey. I know that's probably a popular name, um, but Smokey is a cool name, and I feel like it really suits it suits this gelding so there we go by the way i'm probably gonna make autumn a mare um spotted a mare and these two geldings so huh what do i name you look at her his muzzle oh is that is your mouth i can't tell i love horse muzzles all right let's hmm I mean, immediately when I look at him, I actually think a spirit in some way. But spirit is such a commonly used name. Um, if anybody's watched all my Horse Valley videos, I might take um, a name from there. And I think I might call him Duke. Um, in my Horse Valley Roblox series, my Frisian is actually named Duke. So, I mean, it might suit him. Hmm. Either Duke or Milo. That is hard. I think I might go with Duke. I feel like he'd be like the the leader of the herd. Um, just the leader. He just looks so tough. So we're gonna give him Duke. And now we've we've made it to her. Um, I might just call her Mila. In my Horse Valley series, I have a Clydesdale that is named Myla. So, yeah, I think I might just call her Myla. There we go. Okay, so looks like we have, let me see, we have, of course, Jingle, Myla, Autumn, Smokey, and, of course, Duke. So I think that about covers everything for this video. We have completed our four stalls, and um, it looks really good. I, I'm, I'm super excited to continue this Minecraft series. So hopefully by the next video, we're probably going to be making, I'm going to say the stable, you know, where all the tack is stored, the tack rooms, that kind of thing. That might be a two-parter because that might take a long time to build, depending on how big it is. I don't know. And I might make, like, a couple of these types of stalls um but yeah i really hope you all enjoyed this video remember to click like and subscribe and like i said cannot wait for this series to continue i'll see you all in the next video bye